If you're just getting started within Magma, let's talk about how to navigate your art desk and art space, as well as the differences between them. Here we have an example of a paid professional account. At the top left, we have our art desk, represented by the Magma logo. During the initial login phase, you'll always be directed to your art desk at the start. Think of the art desk as your own personal dashboard that hosts your private artwork collection, where you have full control over who has access to your canvases. Magma members are only able to see select canvases you have invited them to. When activating a canvas within your art desk, this will bring it into view, and we can navigate back to the dashboard by clicking the art desk icon in the top left area of our screen. In this example below our art desk, we have a list of art spaces that we've been creating or we've been invited to. When we enter an art space, you'll see there are different options available in our content list on the left. The art desk organizes our artwork into a single My Artwork channel, while the art space offers the added ability to create projects for different needs. Simply put, an art space offers the ability to give an infinite number of friends or colleagues access to all artwork within an art space's projects, while the art desk organizes all artwork within the My Artworks channel for personal use. Any member who's been invited to join an art space will be able to jump into any project and activate any canvas for editing. In the art space example, we can see all members who have full access to this art space. While all Magma members will have an art desk for their personal artwork, the art space is a separate space that must be created or joined. Art spaces offer an enhanced and highly customizable space dedicated to growing your audience and collaborating with creative teams more efficiently.